Hayden Ross is the pure example of what happens when you participate in no no November. But instead of it being no no November, it's Andrew August, where you basically just do what Andrew does. You don't meet your meat, and you just be a complete terrorist <laughs> on the internet. No, this this man right here, Jesus Christ! When I say this nigga has lost all his fucking marbles because he just decides to stop beating his meat. <laughs> It's like, yo, I don't know why, but this shit is ridiculous. Basically, this this man is going on a downward spiral, and this shit is crazy. Because it kind of, he kind of was going down the downward spiral. It just wasn't really that effective until he basically started meeting with Andrew Tate. Now, I, I'm going to be honest. He, he just, this, this man, Aiden, was always on some zesty shit. Like, this, this nigga would be doing the zestiest shit, saying the zestiest shit on streams and stuff like that. And I don't understand. I, I don't understand how he can, well, well, then again, I don't, I don't really feel surprised at all either. Because this man's audience is basically a bunch of 12 year olds that just basically discovered porn for the first time. And they don't know how to control their horniness, but... Yeah, basically, it's, it's basically crazy. I don't understand how it's just like, damn, you really just have an audience full of kids that don't even know the real effects of porn. <laughs> and if and the, the the chances of making them think they're by curious in some way, shape, or form, and they're not even supposed to be, it's like, bro, I don't know, man. And the controversy you was in, it's like another thing. I'm not even going to mention all those. Like, why would I want to mention those? And this video is not really about specifically the other shits that he's been into that he's been causing, you know, doing crazy shit all. I will limit the fucking crypto shit. Dumb. Honestly, dumb, dumb, dumb idea. I hope nobody actually bought that. I hope somebody literally was sitting there was like, no, I'm not buying that shit. I feel like he had the real intent of basically scamming his audience. I could have sworn he said it on stream too. On someone else's stream, like Kai's stream or something like that, I don't remember. Rather if it was intentional, though, I don't know. But it, it really do look like it was intentional to promote something that obviously was some kind of scam or some shit like that. And it was like, bro. But no, we talking about some shit that this nigga's doing. And I feel like it's really because he has not, he has not flopped the knob. Like, bro, I, I genuinely think if he, can, if he just goes in the bathroom and flops the knob, one time, I guarantee you, he will feel so much better. He will feel more, he will feel more stress relief. He will see all the bullshit he's doing is fucked up. He he will realize he's is wrong and all sorts of shit. But this this celibacy shit that he's doing, this this little facade that he's trying to do because of actual tape, which I still think it's just some kind of facade. Like, ain't no way you idling a nigga that much to a point where you just. You just stop being your meat, but you now doing shit that's worse than being your meat. Like, you, you are literally claiming a whole dude's video because of what you basically did in your entire career. And, and to make it worse, this man was on stream talking about how he managed to... How, uh, um, just just him claiming the video, right? And he's just giddied up about it. This nigga is happy as hell. So happy that this man starts moaning like Riley Reed getting her cheeks blown out. And that shit was like, hey, yo, why is you like, <laughs> why is you that happy? I don't know why you that happy to just ruin a nigga's like, day like that. Like, that's just fucked up. And I don't know how the, how the monetization shit works and how <laughs> the money process of this shit works. Because I'm not monetized. I would love to, but I'm not monetized at the slightest. I would love to so that I can get knowledge on it. So that I can eventually make money on this platform. But, bro, I don't... <laughs> Oh, that's just that's just sick. I don't know, like now that's some real that's some real demonic shit. Like I feel like if the spiritual people were to come out, now I'm saying spiritual and like spiritual, not spiritual. I mean like spiritual. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Like we all know what I mean by spiritual because those type of people I don't fuck with. Like those type of people that just feel like being a part of God just to get close. And I'm saying that because it's, it's true. Like, I've seen so many people after that Travis Scott situation, they were so quick to turn around and, you know, side with God and then start spewing all this God bullshit just because of how the 
you know, area and shit was, and it's like, you know what, I don't even give a fuck, like, niggas would say anything just to get, just to get some kind of recognition to a, to a point where you basically trying to say someone is demonic because they have a singular triangle on their damn arm, like, nigga, this is not that deep, (laughs) we's not gonna see the rapture anytime soon, and if it is, I'm pretty sure those niggas are not gonna be the ones that get picked up, (laughs) like, what the fuck? But yeah, this this man basically was ha- happy about the fact that he basically claimed the nigga's video, and basically is taking all his money. I'm I'm not sure about what the money is made so far, that I think will most likely go to him. But the future money won't. You know what I mean? Stuff like I don't know how that shit works. I don't think they would just. I don't think they would just switch up to where they gonna just end up throwing all the money, even if even the money made during that time, until the month hits where you know you get the payout and stuff like that. I don't think they would do it like that. Now that if that's if that's the case, then that's actually a pretty shitty thing. Especially that to make it worse on Aiden's end because then it's like this nigga is intentionally ruining a nigga's day. Because they made a video on all his bullshit. Like, bro, you can't be you can't be claiming niggas videos and trying to fuck they shit up because of what you did. Like, bro, you were saying the most zestiest shit in the nation. I don't know about... Well, you definitely was doing some zesty shit, too. Like, you definitely was doing some zesty shit, too, at the same time. And... You just don't want to admit the fact that you was on some zesty shit. Like I said, if you just go in the bathroom and rub one off, I'll guarantee you, you will feel so much better. All your all your frustrations will just disappear just like that. And you will just realize just how much shitty you you going to feel once you realize all the shit you have done already. Like, I know somebody going to see somebody going to see this video and be like, "Bro, why are you encouraging that?" Cuz it's true. I feel I really do feel like if this this man the reason why he's doing all this madness shit, including the fact that he including the fact that this nigga on his stream showed porn. Bro. He showed literal porn, bro. How on God's green earth do you show porn to niggas that is younger than fucking what? I want to, well, younger than 14, I should say. You just showing a bunch of niggas what porn is, and they not even supposed to know what that shit is until they at least get to the reasonable age where they won't get traumatized by it. You know what I mean? Like, not not them niggas going to see it. They either will get traumatized about it, or them niggas are going to get addicted about it. You know what I mean? It's, 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 it's bad. And I don't know how, I don't know how, and this nigga's on kick, too. He switched to kick because Twitch said, fuck this nigga. I mean, I don't condone Twitch because even I think Twitch is a sad piece of shit. Bands is what I'm hearing about them giving a dude a lifetime ban over, over something small. But... I, I even bro I even stream I even streamed it on my Twitch with no with no uh with no no censoring or none of that. Uh the fucking girl who was getting her cheek getting her doonies beat down on live on stream, you was you basically was able to see it through the window, right? But I intentionally put my black ass on stream and reacted to that every single clip that was basically there from the moment everybody seen it and recorded uncensored and all sorts of shit and I ain't get banned. <laughs> even if even though I deleted it, I guarantee you I still would have gotten banned regardless because it'd still be in this in the system somewhere and they just be able to pull it up. Like ain't it, it would have got flagged at some point in their system and despite if I deleted it or not, they would have found it. But shit ain't happened to me. And I'm like, okay, well I guess that's the perks of being smaller than a grain of rice, but <laughs> Yeah, like this, like I, I'm Twitch is something else, but this nigga, I don't, I'm, I don't, I mean, I'm kind of I'll side with them the fact that they did eat this man because he's just on some shit. This nigga's just wild and all. Like if he, if he just beats his meat, cause it, if he just goes ahead and beat his meat, like he, he know he can't withstand beating his meat. He might as well let it off and just. And just get it out the way. Like I really think he's just doing all this shit because he hasn't rubbed on off, and his frustrations, his frustrations is just all over the place. <laughs> he just doesn't give no fucks. Like he, he needs, he just needs to rub one off, and he, he'll feel so much better. He, he'll have way more. He'll have way more an ability to take accountability for the shit he did, apologize, and own up to all the shit he did, and make up for it. 
But till then, that, that nigga's gonna be on some some mad 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 max shit. He's, he's gonna be crazy. He's gonna be on some crazy ass shit, and that is what it is. Anyway, that's, that's all I'm gonna say. It uh. I don't know. Maybe, maybe he might see this video. I say he might because that's if he actually gives a fuck. If he gives that much of a fuck, he he'll see this video. So yeah, I'll catch y'all later.